You can save a cold stunned turtle next! Cape Cast! Howdy folks, I'm Eric Williams and welcome to Cape Cast, the official webcast of the Cape Cod Times for November 14th. We get the 411 on Sea Turtle 911 in the second half of the show, but first let's take a look at news. In the fire truck fiasco department, Provincetown hopes to replace a ladder truck that was totaled in a rollover accident last Sunday using about $350,000 in insurance money. Police are investigating Sunday's crash, which occurred during a routine test run. In the pigskin palooza department, the Cape Cod Times and CapeCodOnline.com are proud to present an in-depth look at a week in the life of the undefeated Mashpee High School football team which includes a two-part video by Robert Scott Button. Here's an excerpt. Tell you what, 8-0, no, a great accomplishment, all right? Understand, you always have terrible games. How many turnovers tonight? Nil. We don't turn the ball over, fellas. We are going to be very tough to beat. And we're this far away on every run for breaking a, breaking a huge play. Home, home game, last one of the year, senior night, all right? We got 17 seniors, fellas. We're going to take it on Friday. We're going 9-0. and Let's go. Yeah! If you get in trouble, if you get suspended, you will miss Carver and you will miss Abington. So you need to stay away from stupid stuff tonight, fellas. Great job, great execution. All right, keep your noses clean. Let's go nine and all. Mashpee, one, two, three. Great job, boys. Check out CapeCodOnline.com slash sports for the story, photo gallery, and video. Hey, folks, would you like to help rescue cold, stunned turtles? Check this out. Well, Bob, we're at the beginning of another cold stun sea turtle season. It looks like you've already had some action here. Yeah, yeah. It, um, it was a little slow getting started because it's been such a great fall. But the uh, bay uh, water temperature is now down around uh, 50 degrees, some places a little warmer, some a little colder. And uh, with the winds that we had last week, we did get some turtles in. So we're up to six turtles, five uh, Ridleys and one green sea turtle. Now, where does this usually take place? Um, most of the strandings um, take place, 99% of the strandings take place in Cape Cod Bay, anywhere from Truro to uh, Dennis and occasionally over into Barnstable on Sandy Neck. Now, I understand a lot of times with stuff on the beach or nature in general, folks are told, you know, maybe don't get involved, don't touch it. Right. But here with these cold stunned turtles, there is an opportunity for just regular folks to get involved and there are things they can do to help. Absolutely. Now keep in mind that these are a federally listed endangered species, so you can't remove them from the beach. So what we do ask everybody is, number one, don't put it back in the water. A lot of people, because it's a seal or it's a, let's get it back into the water. Uh, tur uh, turtles, they, these turtles, their heartbeat is one beat a minute. They're, they're out of it. So they have no concept of where they are, but they definitely, it's only going to get cold in the water. So don't put them back in the water. And we ask people to take them above the high tide line so they don't get washed back out before we get down there. And we ask people to put some seaweed over them. That usually it's a very windy day, so you've got a, a hard onshore wind, um, and that's not good for the turtle. You know, they're coming out of, say, 50 degree water, 45 degree water, they're exposed to 30 degree air. That's not a good mix. And then mark them with a piece of wood or a lobster pot buoy or a bait bag or something like that. And then call us at you know, 508-349-2615. And tell me a little bit about how this volunteer army that you has works. When do they get out there and uh, what are the different sort of jobs that these people do? We need people to drive them to Boston. So people are interested in driving to Boston, call us. We'll put you on the list, and you can drive a turtle to Boston and get a behind-the-scenes tour at the aquarium of how these turtles, you know, the recovery that they, they go through. And the other is beach walkers. You know, every day from literally from 6 in the morning till, you know, 4 or 5 o'clock in the evening, on those high tides, we're looking for people to walk specific beaches. The Wellfleet Bay Wildlife Sanctuary is offering Sea Turtle 911 classes on November 15th and 29th from 1 to 3 p.m., for more information, check out massaudubon.org slash Wellfleet. Now let's check the all-important Cape and Islands weather forecast backed by Frost Free Cosmos video. For tonight, showers with a low around 53. For Saturday, showers with a high near 64. And for Sunday, showers with a high near 55. Okay, we've got to get out of here. This has been CapeCast for November 14th. Till next time, see ya! Cape Cast.